Deus in auditorium meum intende. Domine ad adjuvandum me festina. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicuterat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. O merciful Creator, hear in tender pity bow thine ear. Accept the tearful prayer we raise in this our fast of forty days. Each heart is manifest to thee. Thou knowest our infirmity. Repentant now, we seek thy face. Impart to us thy pardoning grace. Our sins are manifold and sore, but spare thou them who sin deplore. And for thine own name's sake make whole The fainting and the weary soul. Grant us to mortify each sense By means of outward abstinence that so from every stain of sin the soul may keep her fast within. Blessed three in one and one in three, Almighty God, we pray to Thee, that thou wouldst now vouchsafe to bless our fast with fruits of righteousness. God has appointed Christ to be the judge of the living and the dead. The Lord's revelation to my master Sit on my right Your foes I will put beneath your feet The Lord will wield from Zion Your scepter of power Rule in the midst of all your foes A prince from the day of your birth On the holy mountains From the womb before the dawn I begot you The Lord has sworn an oath you will not change You are a priest forever A priest like Melchizedek of old The master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his great wrath. He shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, Et in secula seculorum. Amen. God has appointed Christ to be the judge of the living and the dead. 
Happy the man who shows mercy for the Lord's sake. He will stand firm forever. Happy the man who fears the Lord, who takes delight in all his commands. His sons will be powerful on earth. The children of the upright are blessed. Riches and wealth are in his house. His justice stands firm forever. He is a light in the darkness for the upright. He is generous, merciful, and just. The good man takes pity and lends. He conducts his affairs with honor. The just man will never waver. He will be remembered. Forever, he has no fear of evil news. With a firm heart, he trusts in the Lord. With a steadfast heart, he will not fear. He will see the downfall of his foes. Open-handed, he gives to the poor. His justice stands firm forever. His head will be raised in glory. The wicked man sees and is angry, grinds his teeth and fades away. The desire of the wicked leads to doom. Gloria patri et filio et spiritui sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Happy the man who shows mercy for the Lord's sake. He will stand firm forever. Those things which God foretold through His prophets concerning the sufferings that Christ would endure have been fulfilled. Christ suffered for you. And left you an example to have you follow in his footsteps. He did no wrong; no deceit was found in his mouth. When he was insulted, he returned no insult. When he was made to suffer. He did not counter it with threats. Instead, he delivered himself up to the one who judges justly. In his own body, he brought your sins to the cross, so that all of us dead to sin could live in accord with God's will. By his wounds, you were healed. Gloria patri et filio et spiritui sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Those things which God foretold through His prophets. Concerning the sufferings that Christ would endure, have been fulfilled. While all the runners in the stadium take part in the race, the award goes to one man. In that case, run so as to win. Athletes deny themselves all sorts of things. 
they do this to win a crown of leaves that withers, but we a crown that is imperishable. Listen to us, O Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Listen to us, O Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Christ Jesus, hear our humble petitions, for we have sinned against you. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Listen to us, O Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. My son, you have been with me all the time, and everything I have is yours. But we had to feast and rejoice Because your brother was dead And has come to life again He was lost to us And now has been found Magnificat Anima mea dominum Et exultavit spiritus meus in Deo salutari meo. Quia respectit humilitatem ancile sue, et ceenim ex hoc beatum medicent omnes generationes. Quia fecit mi magna qui potens est, et sanctum nomen eu. Et misericordia eus a progenies in progenies, timensibus eum. Fecit potentiam in brachio suo, dispersit superbos mente cordis sui. Deposuit potentes de sede, et exaltavit humile. E suriente simple vit bonis, et divites dimisit in anis. Sushepit Israel puerum suum, recordatus misericordiae sue. Sicut locutus est ad patres nostros, Abraham et semeni eus in secula. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. My son, you have been with me all the time, and everything I have is yours. But we had to feast and rejoice, because your brother was dead, and has come to life again. He was lost to us, and now has been found. Lord, be present to the bishops and priests of your church, who share your role as head and shepherd. May they lead your people to the Father under your guidance. May your angel be with all who travel to keep them safe in soul and body. Teach us to serve the needs of others and to be like you who came to serve, not to be served. Grant that in the human family brother may always help brother so that with your assistance it may be a city compact and strong. Have mercy on all the dead. Bring them to the vision of your glory. Come, Lord, to visit your family. 
Pater Noster, qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra. Panem nostrum, quotidianum da nobis hodie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, et ne nos inducas in tentationem, sed libera nos amalo. O God, who through your word reconcile the human race to yourself in a wonderful way, Grant, we pray, that with prompt devotion and eager faith, the Christian people may hasten toward the solemn celebrations to come. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.